One minute left in the second period. Hey guys, we are back with another Reed Hensick Be a Pro, and we are down 3-1 to one against the Dallas Stars in the third round. Uh, my points so far, 8 goals, 8 assists, 16 points. Hensick has been leading the way for the Anaheim Ducks, but we are, nonetheless, we are down 3-1 to one against the Dallas Stars. So, yeah, we're going into game number 5, and hopefully game number 6, and maybe even 7. Let's go. Okay, I'd just like to point something out. Dallas has an 80 for goaltending. There's no what there's no reason we cannot score against the Dallas Stars. Let's go. All right, boys. Game number five in Dallas. Here we go. This may be the last game of Reed Hensick's NHL 17 career, depending on how it goes. Let's go. Come on, boys. Dallas dumps it in. There is Theodore. He tries to get it in front. Finds Jones on the boards. Jones taking it up. He's dangling. 
He f tries to find Hensick around the net, but cannot. Finds Alexiak instead, and he gets it up where the Stars will dump it in. And, oh, Gibson out of his net right there. Jones finds Hensick on the wing. He's passing it back for Theodore. Almost missed that to Theodore. Theodore back to Jones. Jones up to Theodore. Back to Votnin. Raquel down low to Hensick. Hensick, he is looking for space. He's gets it, he gets it to Jones, who cannot get it to Votnin as Hensick goes for the change on a solid shift, but did not convert nonetheless. And it appears we have a goal here. Who's it going to be? It's going to be for the Dallas Stars. My goodness. Come on, boys. They have an 80 for goaltending. <laughs> we should be able to score at will on these guys. Nice block by Hensick there. And he takes it up. He's getting around. He's power, the power move around. Draws a penalty. Gets it back to Fowler. Over to Lindholm. Takes the shot. Tries to redirect it. Jones holds on to it. Delayed penalty stays. Jones takes a shot on that. Hensick recovers it. Still a delayed penalty here. Fowler for Lindholm who whiffs on it. And the power play is finally underway. As we have a two-minute man advantage here. Lindholm with that shot. Gets into the pads of... Is that Gibson for them too? <laughs> they have a goaltender to Gibson. Oh, man. <laughs> the battle with the Gibsons right here. Ryan Getzlaff taking that face off. Hensick pokes it out of the circle. Over to Hendricks. In the, in the middle, Hen Hensick shoots it on that. Always hard to transition between Hendricks and Hensick. And then Lindholm takes that. Gets it up to Hendricks. Hendricks on the boards. Gets it over Vatnin. Takes that shot blocked in front. And Hensick cannot hold on to it. Gets it down to Hendricks. And back over to Hensick. Over to Lindholm. Takes that shot. Tip in front. And the Anaheim Ducks cannot get anything going on this power play so far. In terms of goals. Had plenty of chances. Just couldn't convert. Alexiak over to Nemeth. Over, back over to Alexiak on the penalty kill. Nice block by Lindholm. As Getzlaff sends it over to Hansik. Who dumps in and goes for the change. And uh, appears we had a whistle right there. What's going to happen here? We do not have a goal as the first period comes to an end. Jesus. All right. Come on, boys. Second period time. All right. <laughs> the towels are out in Dallas. That's not a good sign. Come on, boys. Anaheim, please get a simulation goal for me. 17 minutes. 10 shots on that for the Anaheim Ducks. Cannot get anything going, though, so far. Raquel has that. He's going to get it for Hansik in front. Oh, man. That wrist shot. Blocked by the goaltender Gibson on the Dallas Stars. And Yadmark takes that in. Over to Richie. Brett Richie, I'd, I would say. Battle of the Richies as well. Yanmark takes that shot and goes. Blocker side on John Gibson. And it is 2-0 Dallas early in the second period. That is not good. His third of the playoffs and... Not looking good for Anaheim. Not looking good for Anaheim. We, we got to get a goal sometime this period if we want any chance here against the Dallas Stars in their lethal offense. Raquel, Manson, over to Jones. Who takes that shot, goes wide. Hints over to Fain. Over to Brett Ritchie, who dumps in. And the prayer will cover that. Raquel, up to Hensick. And Hensick... Calling for it too much as he passes it to the Dallas defenseman, Fain. And Hensick will chase that down, even, the coach, even though coach is calling for the change. He's not giving up on the play. And in the middle for Perry. And uh, Perry cannot hold on to that as Hensick will, will finally go for the change. Yikes. Richie taking that in. Do we have a goal here? No, we do not. 8.03 remaining in the second period. Come on, boys. 
Still possible. Plenty of hockey left. Hintz takes that shot wide of the net. Goes back to Jordy Ben, I believe that is. Vatna gets that up to Jones, who gets it to Raquel. Raquel dumps in. Jordy Ben recovers over to Hintz. And a stick infraction for Reed Hensick as the Anaheim Ducks are about to go on the penalty kill if the Dallas Stars don't score here. Alexiak over to Ben. And Jones recovers as Hansen goes to the box. Not good. Not good at all for Anaheim. Let's see what happens here. Five minutes. We are getting back out there as the penalty expires. Nachushkin blocked in front. Jamie Ben and Hensick taking that up. Goes over the wing. Tries to find someone on the point, and he just gets there. Did Manson, and the shot by Dupre, and Gibson covers up as he's not allowing Anna Anaheim Ducks to break through right now. And that was probably the last shift of. Uh, no, it is not, as we get out there with 114 remaining in the second. As Shea Theodore is back there. Over to Raquel, who gets that stretch pass up to Hansik with no Anaheim Ducks in the zone. Until now, Vatnin picks that up for Raquel. Over to Theodore. Over to Raquel. And who tried getting it to Jones. He pokes that up. Jones in the middle for Raquel. Who whiffs on the one-timer. And now the Dallas Stars take it up with 17 seconds to go. Nemeth over to Hintz. Over to Fain. Fain walks in and, oh man, Gibson has to make the save. Yikes. And there's only 5.8 seconds left, so may as well. Oh, all right. We can sim there. Has to be exactly five seconds not to sim. And we're still down to nothing in the, at the end of the second period. Come on, boys. All right. Could be the last period of Reed had six NHL 17 career, boys. Want to get other stuff going on the channel. So something has to go out of the way. And it's got to be Beer Pro at this point. Come on, boys. Do it for Hansik. <laughs> Let's go. Kessler wins that face off, wins the push. Hatzik taking it up. He tries to get past the Dallas defense and does. He's in the middle, tries to find Kessler, but on the penalty kill, and Kessler does not chase that puck. As Dupre takes that, backhands it into the zone. We are in need of a goal, though. So Hansik's being a little bit of aggressive here on the penalty kill. Early in the third period. As Eakin dangles that over to Alexiak. Over to Jordy Ben on the power play as well. Gibson makes that save. Throws it out to Hensick, And Hensick dumps it in. And Kessler gives chase. Along with Jordy Ben. And Kessler absolutely demolishes Jordy Ben. But Kessler cannot hold on to that puck. As Hoodler is in the zone. And a great poke by Theodore, I believe that is. Kessler breaks his stick. And penalty happening here on Dallas. Perfect. So we get a power play, I believe. Or is it 4-on-4 four four at the moment? Yeah, it's 4-on-4. Four four. And then a, an abbreviated power play for the Anaheim Ducks. And neither team converted. As it is still 2-0 midway through the third. That's not good. Mark Fain picks that up. Over to Yanmark. He loses it to Raquel, but the Dallas Stars are back on the power play as Ricard Raquel gets caught. What was that? What was that? Roughing? Or, uh, ooh, ho hooking? Yeah, hooking. <sighs> All right. Come on, boys. Big kill right here, though we do need offense. Ben, over to Sagan. Oh, it almost floats in for the Dallas Stars. And Hatsik dumps that in and gives chase. If the Dallas Stars would get out of his way. <laughs> Jordy Ben, backskating with it. Gets it over to his defensive partner. And Jimmy Alexiak. He takes that in. Gets it in the middle for a wide open Jamie Ben. And that is cleared out by the Anaheim Ducks. Jordy Ben. Tries to find Alexiak, but uh, goes off the wall. But then 
Gets to his intended target. Dupre. Gets that out. Very nice. And the Ducks go for a change. Come on, boys. We just need just need one. Yeah, I know. I know, coach. <laughs> I'm trying to motivate the boys, but they're not doing anything. We can't do anything because we keep trying to kill penalties. Oh, boy. Here comes a goal. Here comes a goal. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? It's probably going to be for the Dallas Stars. Yeah, it's going to be. It's over. 4 nothing for the Dallas Stars in game number five. That's just great. Yeah, it's it's done. It's done. It is done. May as well try to score a fancy goal here or something. For Reed Hensick's last goal. Because, well, at least for NHL 17. Jones up to Vatnin. And uh, Gibson saves <laughs> that. Oh, gosh. Imagine if the whistle didn't blow there. Dallas Stars would have been absolutely outraged. <laughs> and uh, Christopher Gibson is his name, apparently. Yeah, so the 80 overall goaltending of Christopher Gibson was able to beat the 92 overall goaltender in John Gibson. Makes a whole lot of sense. And as Hansik gets that shot off, Matt Scramble in front of the net. Hansik takes that shot that deflects wide. And Dallas is able to get that out with 3.10 remaining. Vatnin flings that around the boards. Where Theodore is met by Janmark. Into the middle for Richie. And this appears to be about it for the Anaheim Ducks. And their dreams of winning the Stanley Cup. Richie takes that shot. Theodore flings it around once again for Tyler Sagan. Not the person you want to fling it around to on the boards. And... Hensick just has to get that out. And he's looking for a fight. And he does not get it. And he's still out there, apparently. Even though the coach was calling for his going to the bench. As the Dallas Stars take that wide shot. Jamie Benn in front. Hensick trying to do something. Loses it to Sagan. An absolutely gassed. Reed Hansick cannot get around. Fain gets it down low for Nachushkin. Over to Fain. Back down low for Nachushkin. Nemeth takes that shot. And Vatnin recovers. He gets that to Hansik, who's still on. And Hansik takes that short side shot that goes wide of the net. And there's not a whole lot of hope left for the Anaheim Ducks. As we are down to the final 45 seconds of the game, there is no hope here as the Dallas Stars will move on to the Stanley Cup Final. Hansik with one final breakaway gets the goal, and this is not a shutout. And that may be Hansik's final goal as an Anaheim Duck, at least in the NHL 17. His ninth of the playoffs. And he goes backhand on the breakaway. And too little too late for the Anaheim Ducks. As they will still fall to the Dallas Stars. Four to one. Well, boys. It was nice while it lasted. Um, you know, unfortunately we couldn't win the Stanley Cup. But we did go pretty far. Further than anyone expected, anyway. We were barely able to make the playoffs, for that matter. So, I mean, I guess it was a good year, but I really wanted that Stanley Cup. So, <sighs> let's get back to that menu. Well, boys, that's about it for this series for Be a Pro in NHL 17. I do want to get some other things going on the channel. Like, I wanna, <laughs> I wanna get some live streams going finally. Like I, like I've said for the past, like three or four or however many months it's been that I've been saying that I wanted to live stream, but it will happen. I just need to find the time to do it. And for me to have time to do that, I needed to terminate one of these series. And I, I enjoy, I enjoy GM mode so much. And you said hockey manager. I mean, that's pretty much GM mode. So I, and I, I enjoy that a lot too. So something had to take the hit and it was be a pro. So I don't know what else I'm going to do on Tuesdays from now on, but uh, you know, maybe uh, maybe live streams. Who knows? <laughs> That's about it for Reed Hensick's career for NHL 17. Unfortunately, we could not win the Stanley Cup because we didn't 
participate in the Stanley Cup uh, playoffs with Montreal. So we, I mean, we technically won it with Montreal again, but we didn't participate in the playoffs. So I'm not going to count that. So I guess I'll see you guys with Reed Hatzik back in NHL 18. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do for NHL 18 yet, but uh, hopefully he'll make a return at some point. And that'll be about it for now. And I mean, who knows? Maybe maybe we'll play some Reed Hansick, uh NHL 17 Beer Pro in the live streams. I mean, I wanted I want to do a lot with the live streams. You know, we can we can a lot of potential there. We can do GM modes. We can do uh, Beer Pro. We could do uh, we could do other games that are not NHL. You know, we could do some maybe some Rocket League. Maybe some uh, you know more interactive stuff than just GM mode or what you guys are used to on the channel. So. As I said, that'll be about it, and thanks for tuning in to Reed Hansick's career, and he'll see you guys hopefully soon. <laughs> I, was, I don't know where I was going with that other than that, uh, but I will see you guys in the next one.